Hey y'all, Captain IRX Guy here, and what I want to do today, and you can find a link within this video's description to where you can order this non-slip tape online. It's very inexpensive, but uh, this is one of Captain IRX Guy's boats, and what I'm going to do, first thing you want to do, if the tongue on your trailer is a folding type, you're going to want to uh, extend that, and then we're going to, I'm going to show you how to remove, how to make a, uh, a boat trailer less slippery because if you've ever launched a boat you know that often there's a lot of uh, a lot of algae and stuff on the boat launch and it makes uh, makes getting in and out of the boat when you launch it kind of dangerous and as it stands right here this is just a, a slippery surface it's painted with a uh, with an anti-corrosive paint the first thing I'm going to want to do is wipe that off because it's got a little bit of dust on it and see potentially any of this because this is the part that one would step on when you when you get in the boat so we're really going to tape it up really nicely and this tapes cool it comes in different colors this is a black and yellow stripe kind of looks like caution tape I liked it But I think they have it in black as well. You can check the uh, the link the link within this video's description to uh, to see what all is available. But I, like I said, I'm using the yellow and black, and now it feels like sandpaper. So what we're going to do? We're going to take this, and it won't take a lot, but you'll just want to make sure that all of these sections where you could potentially put your foot that they have a piece of this on it. It's easy to cut with a standard pair of scissors. It's just like cutting a piece of uh, of sandpaper, except this sandpaper has adhesive on the back. <laughs> it's a very strong adhesive, I can tell already. And just kind of go slowly with it because you don't want to have any bubbles in there. Actually, I left that a little bit too long. So there's one piece and it's very grippy. I'm not going to bother with this section here because I wouldn't put my foot that close to the boat. But I am going to put a nice size piece right here. And you get a lot of this tape. So it's something if it wears, if it happened to wear down after a while, you would have, if your trailer is about the size of mine, you'd likely have uh, some extra to reapply it if you chose to do so. Maybe reapply it every boating season, who knows. And again, just take your time, apply kind of slowly. And since this is a folding tongue on this trailer, I'm going to pull it out and see if it'll still close with that tape. Yeah, it's not, that tape won't interfere because it won't even make contact with that. See, this particular trailer just goes to the side, so it never would hit that. And then this part right here, I'm going to put, I'm going to put a few strips on this.
try to line it up if you want to just to make it look symmetrical. So it doesn't look like a do-it-yourself project even though it is. So that's really grippy and these little pieces that were left over probably just to repurpose them I'm just going to kind of stick them around add a little bit of extra grip. I could cover that whole area if I wanted to but I think it's just a waste of tape in my opinion. And then that'll that'll leave me some in case some of this falls off or or I want to uh, reapply it the next season. I'll have some already. But I am going to put another piece right here. And that's really about the extent of where I would step on this particular trailer. Because you're only going to be stepping on it when you're getting in and out of the boat launch. So again, just a good way to give you extra footing at the boat launch and to save money as well because if you slip and have to uh, have to go get a get a bone replaced or whatever, or repaired rather, <laughs> it's expensive. So this is just a good proactive thing that every boat owner should do in my opinion. So be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. YouTube.com forward slash iRickScow. And enjoy all of Captain Irish Guy's boating videos. Y'all have a good day.